Good day everyone. My name is Lexer Nakabungkal and I'm discussing about logical operators. Well, let's start with the first logical connectors. Negation. The negation of proposition P is denoted by not P. Read as not P and define through its table. Again, negation read as not P. This is the true table of negation. If P, if proposition P is true, then the Q, the, and then the proposition Q is false. And vice versa, kabaligtaran lang. Example, write the negation of each statement. P sub 1 is the cat, does not need to be fed. P sub 2 is 4, is an odd number. We're going to negate that solution in. P sub 1 is the cat need to be fed. Tinanggal lang natin yung not para maging negation. P sub 2 is 4 is not an odd number. Nilagyan lang natin ng not to be to become a negate, negation. Second is conjunction. The conjunction of proposition P is denoted by P and Q. Read as P and Q and define through its table. Again, conjunction read as P and Q. And this is the true table of conjunction. If proposition P is true and proposition Q is true, then the true table is true. If the proposition P is true and proposition Q is false, and the true table is false, again, pag may pag may false agad sa, is, sa isang statement, automatic false na yun. As well as, if the statement are both false, and the, and, and the true table is false. Example, let P and Q be the following proposition. P, today is Monday, Q, it is raining, write the following conjunction as English sentence. Number one is P and Q. Number 2, P and not Q. Number 1, today is Monday and it is raining. As you can see, nilagyan lang natin ng end para maano yung conjunction. Number 2, today is Monday and it is not raining. Pag negation nga, nilagyan, na, nilagyan natin ng not. Okay? And, and. Third, the disjunction. The disjunction of proposition P is denoted by P or Q. Read as P or Q. Again, itong sign na to is OR and defined through its table. And this is the true table of this disjunction. If proposition P is true and proposition Q is true, then the true table is true. If the proposition P is true, then end proposition Q. Q is false, then the true table is true. Pag may nakita naman kayong true dito, automatic true agad. Kung ang conjunction ay false, ang disjunction naman ay true. Pag both false naman ang statement, false na yan. The true table above tell us the disjunction P or Q is false when both disjunction P and Q are false. Fourth, the conditional. The conditional of proposition P is denoted by if P, then Q. Read as if P, then Q and define through its table. Kapag conditional, lalagyan natin ng if and then. And is the true table of conditional. If the first statement is true, and the second statement is true, then the true table is true. If the first statement is true, second statement is false, and the true table is false. If the first statement is false, then and second statement is true, then the true table is true. If both statements are false, then the true table is false. The conditional P if P, and then Q, we also be read as 
P implies Q. The proposition P is called hypothesis, while the proposition Q is called the conclusion. Lastly, the biconditional. The bicondition of a proposition P is denoted by P if if and only if. Read as P if and only if. Again, pag biconditional, lalagyan ng if and only if and define through its table. And this is the true table of biconditional. If the first statement is true and the second statement is true, then the true table is true. If the first statement is true, second statement is false, then the true table is false. Pag may nakita agad kayong false statement, automatic false na yan. But, if the both statements are false, the true table is true. The proposition may also be written as P, I, F, F, if and only if, Q. The proposition P and Q are the components of the biconditional. So, let's proceed with the exercise. Exercise, write each symbolic statement as an English sentence. Use P, Q, R, S, and T as defined below. We're going to translate it into statement. And this is the given. So let's start with the number one. P or R and Q. P, Taylor Swift is a singer. R, Taylor Swift is an actress. Q, Taylor Swift is a not a songwriter. The answer is Taylor Swift is a singer or or Taylor Swift is an actress quit and Taylor Swift is not a songwriter. Ilagyan natin ng or and 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 at kung may napapansin kayo nilagyan natin ng quit dito dahil magkasama ang P and R na statement. Number 2 If not S, then P. If not S, then P. And, and not Q. S is Taylor Swift plays the piano. P, Taylor Swift is a singer. Q, Taylor Swift is not a songwriter. Let's see the answer. If, as you can see, meron tayong conditional sign. If Taylor Swift is not playing piano, this is S, then Taylor Swift is a songwriter, this is P, and Taylor Swift is a singer, it is, I mean, Taylor Swift is a songwriter. So you can see, tinanggal natin yung not para manigit yung Q. Number three, Number three, if P, then Q, and not R. If Taylor Swift is a singer, this is P, then Taylor Swift is not a songwriter, this is Q, and Taylor Swift is not an actress. Nilagyan natin yung not kasi negation of R. Okay, get next. Number four, if, if S and not Q, then P. As you can see, meron ulit tayong conditional sign. The answer is, if Taylor Swift plays the piano and Taylor Swift is a songwriter, negation of Q, tinanggal natin yung not, then Taylor Swift does not play the guitar. This is P. Okay, next. Number 5, R and P. If and only if Q. This is by conditional sign. The answer is Taylor Swift is an actress and this is R and this is, and this is conjunction sign. Taylor Swift is a singer. This is P. 
if and only if this is for by conditional sign taylor swift is not a songwriter okay last number six t if in if and only if r i i mean t if in only if not r and not p the answer is taylor swift does not play the guitar quit tell nga magasama ang r and p if and only if taylor swift is not an actress negation of r nilagyan lang natin ng r ay nilagyan lang natin ng not and Taylor Swift is not a singer negation of P. Nagyan lang ulit natin ng not para maging kabaligtaran. Okay, gets? This is the end of my discussion. Again, I'm Mixerena Kabungkal, your presenter.